Man, it's your boy Miles from Kicking with Red Eye TV, and I am Red Eye TV. Hey everybody, it's your boy Red Eye, aka Mr. Don't Blink, and you know what it is, you are watching Red Eye TV. I'm joined today by the homie QK, out of LA, resides in Tennessee, trying to bring some new flavor to your ear, no Craig Mack, but I need you to listen, and Q, why don't you go ahead and tell a little bit about you and, and what you about, bro? Well, really, man, you know what I'm saying? I'm about, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to be a true artist in the game, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to really establish myself as like, uh, one of the forefronts of the city, you know what I'm saying, on a, on a whole different scale. Uh, just coming with a new flavor, a new sound for the bill, you know what I mean? Being from LA, I have a different sound naturally, so uh, coming down here, man, you know, I, I'm from down here too a little bit, man. I've been down here a lot, you know what I'm saying? I, I went to high school here for a minute, you know what I mean? But uh, LA is just where I was born, you know what I'm saying? Where I spent the majority of my time, you know what I mean? But uh, I call Nashville home too, man, just as much as I do LA. You know? But uh, my whole thing really is, man, I'm trying to be more of like an entrepreneur in the city, man. Establish my brand in different areas uh, besides music, you know what I mean? But, uh, I was a future plans, but it's definitely stuff that I'm working on currently. Right, man. So, being from LA and then residing in the South, there's definitely different styles of music. How do you feel overall music in the industry is as a whole right now? Um, in my opinion, man, I feel like the, the king of rap right now is Kendrick Lamar. You know what I'm saying? I really feel what he's saying. I feel like J. Cole put out a, a great album too. Uh, J. Cole, man, he definitely one of the forefronts, you know what I mean? Uh, I listen to a lot of old school rap, though, man. I'm into Tupac, uh, Nas, you know what I'm saying? Uh, the Jay-Z kind of stuff. But, you know, I like I like a little bit of everything, though. You know what I'm saying? I pay attention to everybody, man. And, uh, you know, I just got love for the whole game of hip-hop, man. I just want to see hip-hop take a different uh, jump, you know what I mean? So, in past conversations with you, man, you know, we, we was talking about music and, and being a rapper and whatnot. How do you plan on differentiating yourself as an artist, not so much being labeled as a rapper? Uh, you know, I, when, I, when I make my projects, man, I just think full quality from top to bottom, man. Just full uh, strategy. Uh, just the art of, of music, you know what I mean? Like, I feel like eventually, you know, I'm already crafting the R&B records for people, you know what I'm saying? Uh, jumping into different avenues and just rap, you know what I'm saying? Uh, but my main focus at this time is rap, you know what I'm saying? Becoming the best artist, rap artist I can, but you know, uh, music, man, I'm just trying to work with anybody. I'm trying to really just bring all that together. Okay. You know what I'm saying? So, if you were to be able to work with anybody locally, it's like say an indie artist, is there anybody on your radars that you would like to maybe uh, get on and bless a track with? Um, definitely Starleto, man. I okay. definitely, Big shouts out to Starleto, yeah, man. Definitely he ain't do anything, man. He's bro. definitely the forefront of the city. Uh, if you want to go back, uh, but one of the OGs of the city, uh, if you want to go back to my original city, LA, I definitely will want to work with some of the uh, more mainstream guys. You know, I, I like Kid Ink, man. I'm a big Kid Ink fan. I like that style of music, you know what I mean? Uh, I like the whole mustard vibe going on right now, you know what I'm saying? But uh, locally, man, I, you know, Bucks, Lido. Uh, I've worked with Darcy Gang already. I've worked with uh, Miles. you know what I'm saying? You did the interview with Miles. Shouts out to Miles, yeah. man. Shouts out to Miles, man. Yeah. 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 Uh, I don't work with some locals, you know what I'm saying, but you know, take the next scale up, you know, but, you know, uh, Jelly Roll. Right. You know I mean? So now we're gonna flip the question a little bit. If you could work with a mainstream artist right now, who would your, your top, say your top three would be? Kendrick Lamar, J. Cole, Nah. Okay. Okay. But, you know, I say that those are my least, but you know, I, I would work with, you know, I like Big Sean, I like, I like Drake. So 
a lot of artists I like, too. But I had to narrow it down to Kendrick, Cole, Nas. Man, I don't know how you feel, but I feel like this man uh, doesn't get a lot of play or recognition. I'm a huge fan of Big Crit, homie. I, I love Crit. Man, I'm trying to yeah. tell you, like, I, I think he, he probably one of the most slept on artists out there in the game Definitely. right now. Exactly. Crit came down here and did a show. And yeah, he soon. shook it, bro. Yeah, he shook that. it. He shut the city Shout down. Big Crit, Crit, come back soon, bro. We yeah. need you out here. Well, that's what's up, man. So, I guess, tell everybody what is different if they came to see your show compared to anybody else that they going out to. You know what I'm saying? Because you go to a lot of these shows of, of, of rappers, and it's just a dude standing there with a mic rapping at somebody. Now, what what's the difference between your show and, and one of them shows? I would say with my shows, man, respect, respect uh, a party, first of all, you know what I'm saying? Okay. My whole thing is, I, you know, I do the parties too, you know what I'm saying, with the performances. So my whole thing is, I want you to have a great time, you know, all in all, you know what I'm saying, from the opener to the closer, you know what I mean? But I'm, when I'm coming, man, I'm coming with that energy, you know what I'm saying, I'm coming with great music to just vibe out to, to just listen to. I'm just coming with a different style, man. I feel like a lot of people are gonna like it, a lot of people are gonna latch on to it real quick. So, what makes your style different than all the other styles out there right now? What would you say be the main main focus on that? Uh, the fact that it's me, you know what I'm saying? The fact that it's original. You know what I mean, it's, uh, it's me, you know what I'm saying? That's what I say. I come at it from a true artist perspective. So, it's like whatever I create at that time, you know what I mean? That's just what it is. I'm influenced by a lot of people, you know what I'm saying? But how I feel at that time, you know, I just feel from there and that's just how I feel. Now, you touched on it a little bit before about, uh, you know, having a party atmosphere. Tell us a little bit about Hard Bodies and your, your relation with them and uh, what you do with that. Uh, hard Bodies is actually a, a uh, emotional company that was started with. It's really, it really started with myself, you know what I'm saying, for my own shows. Cause, I look at it like I want to be 100% independent. You know what I mean? Like that's why I take that role like a, a, a really you know, a boss type role because I want it just to be um, just separate. You know what I'm saying? I want to do my business and different things. So it's like the promotional company started as a way to promote myself, and now it's a way that I'm promoting other artists. Um, it's, it consists of me, and two of, two of my homegirls, uh, really three, but it's only two of them right now. So. So being down in the South here in the music scene, what would you say the state of the music scene is here in Nashville? You know, we're predominantly known as a country music city. So tell us, what's the state of hip hop here in Nashville to you? Uh, to me, the state of hip hop is uh, in Nashville. Uh, you know, the city can use some flavor. You know, I hear a lot of kids, uh, I hear a lot of people like cats out here, man. I hear 808 Quake, uh, you know what I'm saying? He's shaking the city, you know what I mean? Uh, like I said, Miley's shaking the city, Garcia Gang. Um, I mean, there's people out here shaking the city, man, but you know, it's a country music city uh, base, so that's, that's the only thing that's hard to kind of wipe clean, but when I think about Nashville, I think about St. Louis, man. I think about a city that could uh, really just come out of nowhere and just be hot, one of the hottest cities, because the talent is in the city, man. I, I work with these artists all the time, Trey Stoner, you know what I mean? I work with these guys all the time, so it's like, the talent is in the city, man. We all just gotta really just come behind each other and really push the city. And I feel like the more we all push the city, you know, the city's just gonna naturally get out of I think the biggest, the biggest downfall is everybody trying to be too independent, you know what I'm saying? Right, like, right, right. People don't understand if you to go out and buy a car today, if everybody in the city went to go buy a car today, you can't go to the same car lot and buy a car. Right. That don't mean not everybody can go buy a car though. You know what I'm saying? There's so much avenues and ways to do things, but you know, it, it, it does take a team. You know what I'm saying? Like you say, you got a team with you. It takes a team to make a movement happen. So many, so many cats don't want to get that response. It's hard, you know what I'm saying, when it's your career. Right. You know what I'm saying? But if you pick the right team around you, you know what I'm saying? You, Championship. Yeah, I surround myself with all winners, man. There you know what I'm saying? I got my boy uh, C. Hudson. I got my boy E. Campbell. I got my boy Kodak, Mo C. That's my core team, man. We get it in, man. Like, uh, really, that's where the, the hits gonna come from, you know what I'm saying? But you gotta have a team, but you gotta come together with other teams right. so the city can win a championship. Right. You know what I'm saying? That's like, real. That's why I fuck with Red Eye, you know what I'm saying? And, and like, 
I, I just, I, everybody moving, you know what I'm saying? Like, the city got to come together. When the city, look at Atlanta, you know what I mean? They came together, they support each other. Nashville's one step away. Man. That's right. I mean, like, the talent, the talent is crazy here in Nashville. Right. Okay. And I think the biggest thing is, like I said, is working together. And there's a structure, you know what I'm saying? There is a structure involved to make things happen. Right. You can't just roll out of bed and I'm going to be successful today. You right. know what I'm saying? It does take the work. It does take the grind. It does take the hate. You know what I'm saying? So then you can turn it into shine. You know what I'm saying? That's my little rhyme for y'all today. Go ahead and lock that in. You know what I'm saying? Hashtag don't blame me what I do. Um, but I mean, we're okay, we're knocking on 2015's door. What's in store for QK, man? What have people got to look forward to in 2015 coming out of you? Man, you know, currently, First of all, 2014 was a great year for me. You know what I'm saying? I did a lot this year. I feel like 2015 is gonna be about me more just establishing my brand, the QK brand, and just getting other brands I'm, I'm involved with. You know what I mean? Like just really establishing that and just making that foundation for that. 2015 is about establishing things. Um, it's just expanding. That's all 2015 is about, man. I got maybe two, two or three projects coming out. I got the House Party EP. My boy Peso coming out uh, January uh, 17th. Uh, got the Casual Radio January 3rd. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I'm working on the tape right now. Uh, it's actually produced by my boy C. Hudson uh, called Beast Mode. That'll be dropping like around, I say, like the late bladder of the year, you know, 2015, probably around uh, something like that. With it. Uh, that's something I'm working on currently, though. Know. But uh, right now, man, you know, I got the No Remorse already out on that pill. I got the QK show already out on that pill. Uh, I guess touching on that, tell everybody where they can go to hear your music, like your pages, follow you, be an instant fan, and keep up with what's going on with your movement, bro. It's your boy QK, and I am Red Eye TV. Don't blink. We can take it there. I can take it there. You can take it there. Cause no one else can pair. Miss Independent. Let me take it. Pack so loud, catch a contact. Once I pull off with your machine, coming back. Let my pesos do my talking, that's a hundred flat. Top five in the city, I'm just stating facts. Got the trunk bumping like it's a drum in the back. Then I'm gone in the flash, nickname Thundercat. Golden Child coming up, that's a well-known fact. Two classes back to back, that's a well-known stat. Gave these niggas no remorse, this the QK show. Papa Molly, throw it up, that's what you came here for. Truck loads full of chicks coming in by the phone. No seeds in my guard, in the cut, rolling dro. Oh, that's a chick, I ain't know Why she winking at your boy with the meat, that's a go Oh, that's a tip, I ain't know Do your chick some extra dollars, she looking at you like no It's my verse off my single, man The Molly Party with Peso, man House Party EP January 17 on that piff, man It's going down Your boy QK Signing off, Red Eye TV, man Take you from the front, now we Yeah, man, uh, I just want to give a shout out to uh, my boy Miles, you know what I'm saying? Uh, Garcy Gang, uh, Hard Body Promotions. Uh, I just want to give a shout out, man. Uh, shout out to C. Hudson, shout out to E. Campbell, uh, shout out to my boy Kodak, my boy Mo C. That's the team, you know what I mean? Uh, 
you know, shout out to everybody, really, man. Shout out to my family, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to my peoples in uh, Asheville, North Carolina. I, I stayed down there for a little minute. Shout out to my people uh, back home in L.A., you know what I'm saying? Shout out to my people in the Ville, man. Everybody I you know, know in the Ville who know me, you know what I'm saying? Just shout out to everybody, man. Like, really, uh, that's my shout outs, man. You know, shout out to everybody, you know what I mean? If I forgot you, you know, what no purpose, you know what I'm saying? You know, but shout out to everybody, man. To me, you timeless. Let me show you something. You need a reminder. I get behind you, break it down. Now roll up the ganja. The type of places I be rolling on people that never find you. I'm the man where I go, and that's just a reminder. I've been my coop, no roof. To me, them prices minor. But what I give is major. She blowing up the pager. I hit her back like lead a key. Be Once again, I'd like to thank QK for coming on now, hooking us up with this in depth interview. I hope y'all learned something. Um, I hope y'all, for one, y'all already on your phone liking and following this cat, listening to the music. Because, I mean, dude got a good stage presence, man, when it comes to his lyrics, man. I think I think y'all gonna dig it. So, once again, man, appreciate you for coming out. Hitting it up with me, you know what I'm saying? And, uh, man, I don't know what else to tell y'all, but stay tuned. And, of course, don't blame me. Wanting more, gave you the keys for shopping sprees. Your wish and stop with me. The way you got it locked, I think I need to cop a plea. Red light special tonight, so trust me, ain't no stopping me. I'm watching you, you watching me. Now watch me fold your knees. So tell me what's my options. The shower or the bed. Just let me show you what I'm saying. That's enough said. I know you down to ride or die, so we gon' break bread. First, let me open your legs, cause I ain't never scared. Take your mind to my dimension, out this atmosphere. Ain't too many like me, only a few can pair. Take you from the front, now we in the 